Hi, I'm the Catholic Mission Chick, and today I'm going to discuss the sign of peace. The sign of peace is when you hug and kiss your family, or if you are not with your family, you awkwardly shake hands with the people around you and say, peace be with you. But these days, the Catholic Church has gone along with the germaphobe movement. The Catholic Church has stated that since hand-to-hand -hand contact is one way of transmitting flu and other viruses, and that since cold and flu season is upon us, we once again recommend that at the sign of peace, you exchange a greeting other than a handshake. Now, these greetings other than a handshake can make the sign of peace even more confusing. Now, the church says you can exchange the sign of peace verbally or with a smile and a bow of the head. Well, Many people have deviated from these suggestions. People smile and do the wave with the hand thing, but they don't want to shake your hand. People don't know about the new germaphobe movement, and they still try and reach out to shake your hand. Some of these people will get a handshake, but other people will continue smiling and waving. Well, sometimes I go to church by myself and I get like anxiety when the sign of peace is coming because I don't know who to turn to first and I look around and see if they're with their families and then when the sign of peace comes, I turn to whoever and then I may get the awkward wave and smile or the handshake and then I feel bad so I just give them a handshake and then maybe they'll just won't get a sign of peace for me because all of a sudden the Lamb of God comes on and I'm just like, crap, I didn't get to shake your hand. Anyway, I'm sorry, I feel bad next time. Anyway, so if you're interested in hearing more about the Catholic Church from my perspective of the Catholic Mission Chick, subscribe to my channel and yeah. So subscribe to me and if you want, you can comment on your experiences with the sign of peace.